Today we are learning to create a counting sequence that increases by twos. This is because skip counting is a useful way of counting large groups of items. We can count by two when counting two dollar coins and pairs of objects. What I'm looking for is for you to be able to count by two from any starting point, to use a number line to skip every second number, and identify a twos pattern on a hundreds chart. Vocabulary you will hear in this lesson include skip count, twos pattern, even numbers, number line, hundreds chart. The materials you will need for today's lesson are pencil and paper, or if you have them, a whiteboard and texter. So here we have a hundreds chart and as you can see, it has all of the numbers starting at one and ending all the way at 100. A hundreds chart is a very useful tool for you to use when you are trying to learn your skip counting patterns. So with my texter, I'm going to show you how to identify the twos skip counting pattern. Now when we count by two, the traditional number we can begin at is of course the number two. In order to skip count by twos, we need to do as the name suggests. We skip a number. When we're skip counting by twos, we skip every second number. One, two. So the next number in our pattern is four. Let's skip again. One, two. The next number is six. Let's keep skipping. If you were to continue the pattern, what would the next number be? You are correct. It would be 32. On your whiteboard or piece of paper, can you work out the next three numbers in the pattern? When we skip count by twos, we can see some interesting patterns forming. First of all, the numbers that are in the two skip counting pattern are what we call even numbers. They end with two, four, six, eight, and zero. And I can see as we follow the numbers that have been circled in this pattern that those numbers occur again and again. Two, four, six, eight, zero. Two, four, six, eight, zero. Two, four, six, eight, and zero. The only number that changes is the one in the front, which is what we call a tens digit. This row, the tens digit is one, 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 one. Then once we get to 20, the tens digit changes to two, 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 two etc. Now that we know how to skip count by two, starting at our traditional number of two, we should be able to skip count by two starting at any number, following the repeating pattern of two, four, six, eight, and zero. So if I were to select the number 26, I should be able to continue counting by twos following the pattern. 6, 8, 0. To check if I've done this correctly, I can skip every second number. 1, 2, 1, 2. <laughs> number line to count by twos would be to draw yourself a line. Pick any number to start at. So we might start 
skip counting by twos from the number 10. You can add a few dashes onto your number line and you can write below the numbers that belong to the two skip counting pattern and you can whisper above the numbers that don't. It would sound like this. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 20, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20. We are counting by twos and how do I know? Well, I can check for the repeating pattern. 0, 2, 4, 6, 8, 0, 